Greetings, I am Reverend Elaine McCollins Flake, and I'm currently serving as the senior pastor of the Greater Allen Cathedral in New York City. I'm a native of Memphis, Tennessee, and a proud graduate of Fisk University. I also graduated with a master's from Boston University and my Master's of Divinity from Union Theological Seminary. I have been married to the Reverend Floyd Harold Flake for 46 years, and for 45 of those years, he was the senior pastor of Allen AME Church. He retired in June 2021, and it was upon his retirement that I was given the appointment to Allen, making me the first female to pastor the leading church in the denomination. Throughout my time at Allen, women's ministry has been a primary focus for me, with children and education being a very close second. While at Allen, I have started a women's ministry and hosted women's conferences. I was one of the founders of the Allen Christian School and the Allen Women's Resource Center, which houses women, children, and men who are victims of domestic violence. I was ordained an itinerant elder in the African Methodist Episcopal Church in 1993, and I would like to go on record as saying, I love God, I love the church, I love the people of God, and I love Christian ministry. I'm grateful to the history makers for affording me this opportunity to speak of those who have influenced me in my walk in ministry. There are many, but I'd like to speak briefly about three of them. The first is my former pastor, Bishop John Richard Bryant. While in Boston, I experienced church as I never had before dynamic worship, community and global outreach, and a pastor who preached spiritual transformation in a way that I had never experienced. I also would like to add that it was at St. Paul that I saw uh, my first ordained woman in ministry. The second person is his wife, the Reverend Cecilia Williams Bryant. While I, I saw, while I was at St. Paul, I saw women allowed to move in church in, and ministry in ways uh, that this Baptist born and bred child had never seen. The wife of my pastor was a powerful presence in the church. She poured into the women to the degree that we began to see ourselves differently. She birthed leaders and spiritual midwives and preachers even before she became a preacher. I would have to uh, uh, let the world know that it was from her ministry uh, that I was able to flourish and I was able to thrive. I've been able to flourish and thrive in ministry here at Allen. And lastly, my biggest influencer is my husband, the Reverend Floyd Harold Flake. He entered the pastorate, as I said, shortly after our marriage in 1975. I watched him do ministry in ways that I could have never imagined. His belief was that when a pastor is called to a church, he, he or she is also called to the community in which that church is located. I saw my husband build a strong church, implementing great worship, meaningful ministries, and preaching sermons that drew thousands to Christ. I saw him work overtime, transforming a community. He led the congregation in building senior housing and affordable housing. He built a school and so much more. His determination to provide housing and schools and safety for the Jamaica community inspired me uh, to not only work with him to carry out his vision, but his vision influenced my vision, and I am honored that he pushed me and inspired me to become who I am in the kingdom. Ministry has been great for me, and I thank God for the opportunity 
to serve the Lord in spirit and in truth and to preach his word to all who will hear.